It's been one month since the milk vein showed up on uh, Nugget here. And like I said in that first video, it's usually two weeks to one month from the time the milk veins show up until they have a baby. So come in here and we'll show you what the milk veins were. Okay, if you see this protrusion or bump here, try to get like a profile of that. See, it's a ways in front of the udder, which is back here. Oh, babe. And this, those got, those got this big at one point, and they flow into this bag, and uh, the udder. Now the udder is is descended and hard, but it's not full. It's pushing down quite a bit now. See how it moves? That'll be so tight it won't move like that. No, no, no. Once she has it, so she's not ready for tonight. But then we can look at this up here. See how the tailbone has dropped quite a bit. This happens a couple weeks, over a couple week span. That's dropped down. These muscles here are totally relaxed. Now this big hamstring muscle for pushing, the night that she has it, it'll get like jelly and be really soft. And her opening will get softer. And this in here, see that's already relaxing. These muscles are relaxing. This muscle's not, this muscle is. Tailbone muscles have relaxed. She's preparing, but she's not ready. It won't come tonight. So, she's making us wait longer. These maiden mares on their first foal, the waiting game is horrible, especially when you don't know when they were bred. So, she's already pushing the one month from the milk veins. She's gotta go soon, but we're waiting for a change in those bags. She's still walking good. Another thing you can watch for is an off stride in the back. She's got a really good walk. <laughs> Another thing is like, they'll be shifting on those back legs a lot getting that baby situated. They'll lay down on one side, they'll get up, they'll lay down on the other side, getting that baby turned and coming up into that birth canal. So that baby's laid in here, and when he gets ready, he has to turn and come up like this, real high, and then out through here. So she'll have to contort her body that day before she has the baby to get that ready, and she hasn't been doing any of that, so. No baby tonight, but we decided to put April and uh, Faith out in her pen and keep her in the barn where we can keep a better look eye on her. Plus, that way we have two less stalls to clean and less horses to water in the barn. Thanks for watching, and we'll keep you updated, maybe even go live when she's in labor because we can see this pen from our bedroom window and I leave one light on and I watch all night long. I don't sleep at all when they're about to have a foal. So if you wanna watch and pay attention when she's having a baby, make sure you hit the subscribe button, turn your notifications on, make comments, and subscribe. See you later.